hello everyone. This is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot. And this is going to be for the sun, moon, and rising sign of Leo. Leo, this is your weekly general reading for the 25th through the 31st of May 2020. Please keep in mind this is an intuitive reading. Now, Leo, I'm using the tea leaf and I'm also using the Morgan Greer Tarot for your weekly general messages. All right, Leo, let's see what energies we have here for you. We've got the turkey. We've, we have bouquet. And we have frying pan. All right. Leo, you're definitely, <clears throat> excuse me, dealing with somebody that, um, is really acting ignorant okay that's when i <laughs> i mean bless your heart give me just a moment yeah you know you, you've got somebody that's causing you uh some bs at this time All right, Spirit, Leo, what messages do you have for Leo? Thank you, Spirit. Twenty fifth through the thirty first, Spirit. Leo, I'm getting somebody is very jealous of you. Very jealous, okay? I feel like they're looking at you, you're shining, you're standing out, uh, you may have recently had some success, some victory, okay, and it's just eating them up, and that's awful, it's horrible that people can be that way, but that's what I'm getting here, and I see somebody, you know, really trying to stir up, you know, some drama here. All right, current situation, we have the Three of Rods. In your foundation, we have the Six of Cups. What's benefiting you this week is the Seven of Pentacles. All right, in your crowning position, Seven of Rods. Well, you're not going to back down either. You're going to stand in your truth. And your outcome energy, look at that. Look at that, Leo. Nine of Cups. All right. So whoever is stirring the pot here, causing this, um, this anxiety, this stress, I, I feel like you're already, if this message is for you, you already know who this person is, okay? And you're going to come out on top, all right? It, it doesn't... You know, I know that doesn't make it any easier to deal with what this person is causing right here. But you're still going to come out on top, and I want you to know that, okay? Now, you do have the number 7 coming up here. So you have twice the number 77. I always tell you guys, go and Google the angel number meaning because it will bring more clarity into your situation. Now, you've got the turkey. Someone is behaving stupidly. Leo, you know who this is, okay? You know, I feel like this is somebody you've known for a long time, maybe even back since childhood, okay? You have a soul connection with this person. And I feel like they're coming from a space where they feel like you're outshining them, okay? Very interesting. And they're causing strife with the frying pan, trouble, accusations. Someone... Uh, you know, may have tried to uh, stir the pot with the relationship you're in. This could maybe try to cause trouble for you at your job, okay? What you do on a day-to-day -day basis. This could even be somebody trying to come in and cause problems between you and your family. Now, we do have bouquet coming up here. Compliments from an admirer. And this jealousy could be uh, coming from this as well. Uh, you know, this could be a friend of yours that maybe they like the person that likes you and they know this person likes you, okay? 
Uh, that very well could be the case. Now, for some of you, I definitely feel like uh, you're going to be receiving a gift, maybe some flowers, or someone's going to be letting their intentions be known to you that they've, you know, they're interested in you. And I feel like, you know, this could come as a shock for some of you, okay? I feel like you weren't seeing it coming, all right? So we've got the three of rods coming up. Here's your current situation. You know, you are definitely planting seeds. You're, you're nurturing those seeds, all right? You're putting a lot out into the universe. And, you know, you know that something's going to be coming back here with what you put out. And you're waiting. And I feel like you're not going to be waiting for long because your outcome energy, like I said, here comes this, this wish fulfillment, happiness, your cup runneth over. So uh, I definitely feel like by the end of the week, you're going to be getting something coming back here threefold that you've been putting out. Now, many of you, this talks about you having foresight about where you're headed where you're going, you've got a plan here. And this is that energy of waiting on your ships to come in. You know you put in the the work and you know something's gonna come to fruition. And I like I said, don't worry, you're not gonna be waiting very long. All right, that is so positive. Now you got the six of cups coming up here in your foundation. This is what's moving you forward. This is what's driving you this week. Like I said, for whoever this message is about having somebody that, you know, I feel like is just trying to sabotage you. You've known this person for a long time. This could even be a relationship, and that's awful. Yeah, but you see it for what it is, okay, and you are going to stand up for yourself. And I see you, you know, maybe walking away from this person uh, for a period of time. But I do feel like this is somebody that you are so connected with. I feel like this is really painful that this person is causing this strife that's doing this to you. You know, bless your heart. Shame on them. That's what I'm getting with this energy. Now, another thing I am getting for many of you, you've got blessings and opportunities coming your way. And it has to do with this three of rods, what you've put out into the universe coming back here that's going to bring in this nine of cups energy and i am getting this energy of some of you there's a need to be a bit more playful and not be so serious at this time now you've got the seven of pentacles coming up here in the position of what's benefiting you this week i love this because this talks about you are definitely tending to a garden here you you are putting in you know a lot of time and hard work some of you are definitely thinking about going back to school you're thinking about investing some money in a business a money making opportunity or this is you investing you know maybe that money in yourself in getting a business up off the ground you could be partnering up with someone okay i feel like this is an investment that you're going to be making you, you've got it on your mind and it's going to be for the betterment of your situation and not only is it going to be a good investment, this is something I feel like whatever this has to do with Leo, it's going to bring long-term financial gain here for you and your situation. <clears throat> Excuse me, Leo. Now we've got the seven of rods coming up here in your crowning position. All right, this is what you know. This is what you're thinking about. This is definitely you defending what's yours, what you're building, what you're creating. You're not backing down from whatever this has to do with, with this person behaving stupidly, trouble, accusations. You're standing in your truth. You're defending what's yours, okay? And you have every right to. You have the gaining advantage here, Leo. You have the upper hand. This could be you protecting your business, your career, you know, protecting your family. You're not putting up with anybody's BS. And you're definitely not going to back down here. And I feel like that's what's needed. You're putting someone in their place. And, you know, I usually don't say that that's, you know, uh, something that's good to do. But a lot of times, you guys, you have to stand up for, for what's 
your truth is and, and what's going on, especially when somebody is lying on you, maybe spreading rumors or trying to get you fired or just trying to cause trouble, period. There's a need for you to stand, uh, stand your ground here, and you're definitely doing it. Now, we've got the Nine of Cups coming up. Here's your outcome energy. I love it. So what you've been waiting on here to come to fruition, to materialize. Here it is. Your cup runneth over times nine. Okay? Blessings, opportunities coming in here. Whatever this has to do with, it's like a your prayers have been heard and answered. It's that wish fulfillment energy. It's, you know, your dreams coming true right here. And it's bringing you emotional satisfaction and joy right here. Harmony in your life. It's something very fulfilling. This could be an opportunity coming in here that is a golden opportunity. It could be career or business related. You know, it's, it's a beautiful energy. And remember, you've worked hard for this. You deserve this. All right, Leo. This message here was, is for you. You're dealing with somebody uh, that's really challenging your patience. You know, I, I wish you the best of luck in this situation. I'll keep you in my prayers. Just know you're coming out on top, okay? You have the gaining advantage here, okay? All right, Leo. I love each and every one of you with all of my heart. Please leave me a comment. Let me know how these energies are playing out in your situation. I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye, Leo.